Hello everyone, welcome. Today I'd like to share with you my favorite travel destination. After being stuck at home for such a long time, I am so eager to start traveling again. So for those of you who know me, this will be an easy one. What's my number one travel destination? Here's a hint. And if you guessed Italy, then you are absolutely correct. In fact, it is Amalfi Coast, Italy. One of my favorite destinations in the entire world. What's your favorite travel destination? If you have one, please do share with me and leave it in the comment section below. And a special thank you goes out to Dark Golan for allowing me to use his royalty-free music on my video. I've traveled to many countries around the world and traveling is one of my favorite pastimes. I absolutely love the thrill of traveling. Of course, I'm not a huge fan of flying on a plane, but to get to where I'm going, I'm going to need to do that. So, that's what I do. I love traveling to all types of destinations around the world, and in fact, I've been to every continent in the world so far. But Italy, south of Italy to be specific, has stolen my heart like the romantic country that it is, just as the men of Italy. <laughs> One of the very first things that I enjoy on my way to Italy is sitting at a window seat in the plane and enjoying the views from up above whilst I fly across the world to get to Italy. I enjoy looking at the waves of the ocean from afar and of course, once I land in Naples, my favorite thing to see is my baggage on the carousel which tells me that I have arrived at my destination and it's time to go to Amalfi Coast. Look at that stunning view. Isn't it absolutely gorgeous? One of the very few things that I enjoy specifically when I'm in Italy is having a cappuccino. I'm not usually a huge coffee fan and for good reason. I don't think that anywhere else in the world, probably besides Paris, has great coffee as the Amalfi Coast. So I do enjoy a good cappuccino once I'm in Italy. And of course, no cappuccino on the Amalfi Coast is complete without freshly baked croissants. baked to perfection and sometimes filled with chocolate or lemon curd from the beautiful fresh lemons that are grown all around the Amalfi Coast. Mmm, yum! Another thing that I really enjoy doing on the Amalfi Coast is going to the market. I really enjoy the freshness of the food that I get there such beautiful fresh tomatoes and of course later on I will have a delicious meal a fresh mozzarella basil balsamico and the fresh tomatoes let's not forget about the seafood mm, fresh mozzarella I thoroughly enjoy it and please don't forget the lemon cello. If you're in Italy and you are not hungry, something is absolutely wrong with you. <laughs> oh my goodness, this gastronomical event that happens, the beauty of the food that they serve in Italy from fresh pasta and gnocchi and of course fresh seafood. Let's not forget that one 
very daring glass of wine from the beautiful vineyards of the Tuscany vineyards. With full bellies, it's time for us to go out for a drive along the Amalfi Coast where we can enjoy the spectacular views of huge mountain and the beautiful Mediterranean Sea looking back at us. Isn't it gorgeous? Wow! Such beauty to explore. And let's go all the way up to Ravello, where I sit and enjoy a cocktail at the beautiful Palazzo Lavino and enjoy the sunset. As we're talking about sights to behold, don't forget to visit the cathedrals that line the coast of the Amalfi with such beauty. And on the hot summer days, I love going for a dip in one of the beaches along the coast. Always so refreshing. And the locals are always so friendly and very helpful. So, no problem at all. Here are the stunning views that takes you across to the island of Capri. Another treasure on the Italian southern coast. I've come to the end of my video today and I do hope that you enjoyed this trip down memory lane with me. If you enjoyed it, please don't forget to hit the like button and I would love it if you would subscribe to my channel and of course don't forget to leave your comments in this comment section below letting me know what's your favorite place to travel to. My name is Natasha, saying ciao for now.